Hey, it's your boy Flexness who wants you to stop being broke and get some cash. Wait, don't hear cash you think it's a thousand dollars a day. Come on, I can't even get a thousand in a whole month. Anyways, you read the title, I'm gonna show you how I made my first hundred bucks on Redbubble. Okay, let's make something clear first. Redbubble is not the website that's gonna make you rich. You're not going to make ten thousand dollars a month. Let's be real, this is not merch by Amazon. I personally make between four hundred and six hundred dollars a month, but with more than three thousand designs, and I'm definitely sure that most of you guys have less than let's say 500 designs maybe less maybe you have less than 100 right well the point is i did put a lot of effort to make them sometimes i skip college to continue designing i don't recommend that of course but i'm just making a point clear which is you gotta put a lot of time in order to get sales most of the time you're gonna put it on the niche research believe me you don't want to spend your time designing something that probably not gonna sell so the niche research costs a lot of time well i did show you one of the ways that i use to find niche but it's not gonna give you the fast sales that you want because most of those niches are evergreen not 100% trends and if you don't know the difference between evergreen and trends evergreen sells all the time I mean all the year like every month sales but the trends have a specific time like a week maybe a couple of days depends I guess you got it guys anyway yeah, stick with me I'll show you when I got my first hundred dollars and how exactly I did it I've started my Redbubble shop in August last year, so it's been more than a year now. My first 3 months I did not design much, just one design a day, maybe two. Anyway, in this whole 3 months I uploaded almost like 80 designs I guess, I don't know, maybe this like 80, between 80 and 90. But in the last days of October I started uploading regularly, like 8 designs per day, sometimes 15, depends on the day. But the point is I was uploading every single day. So after this daily upload, I've seen results, I start selling. My first payment was in November, it was $40, but you can see here that I was selling t-shirts for 1 cent profit i had no idea that my profit was so low so i can easily here get like 12 dollars i guess in profit like three dollars per t-shirt but i had no idea about the margin and the profit if you guys want me to make a video explaining the best margin you can do so if i see you in the comments one day i'm gonna make the video well my second month was the last month in the year december i earned 61 dollars so yeah, this two months exactly, I made my first hundred dollars. Well, to be more specific, my first hundred and one dollars. I was using a strategy back then, of course. I was really targeting the trends, like I didn't even design a single evergreen. It was all trends, so how I did it? Guess what? The answer of that question, you are using it every single day. I'm giving you five seconds to guess what it is. One, two, three, four, four and a half. 5. Time's up. The answer is Twitter. Dude, come on, Twitter, you are using it every single day. At least if you are an average Facebook user. Come on, you love Mark? Dude, this guy is scary, look at his eyes. Anyway, now I'm gonna show you how I use Twitter to get the trends. So, we are in Twitter now. The trends are in front of you here. You go to show more here, and you see all the trends that are going on today. You know, like, uh, this is Korean thing, okay. Hometown, cha cha, that's saying you. Okay, that's Korean Siri. Okay, Korean Siri, that's good, like Squid Game, I don't know. You can go for this one, but you have to check the copyright and trademark, of course. You know? One Piece, it's uh, copyright. Arcane, yeah, it's a Siri too. We have Wong Wong. I don't know about that, but you have to check it, you know? You got the idea. That's the trends are going on in the United States. You find something. Oh, that's a lot of Korean things here. Okay, that's not. Anyway, you got the idea. That's what's happening in the United States now. You gotta put some designs about them. But make sure first you check the copyright and the trademark. You don't want your shop to be deleted, right? That's it. I don't know. There is nothing complicated about that. But you just have to put some work. I mean, you have to design things. Not just design one. You see a, you see a f trend here. And all you do is one design, put it in red bubble and wait for sales. Come on, you have to put like 5, 10. About the same trend, you know? So you have a lot of chances to get your design sale. So I hope you did learn this strategy. It's not that complicated. It's simple, but you have to put the effort. Anyway, don't forget like and subscribe. See ya.